Twice some quantity file is Amazon's most basic flat food file and cannot be used for creating SKUs. It can only be used for changing the price, the maximum minimum price, the quantity and the lead time to ship. The SKU here is what is seen under Manage Inventory. If we look under Inventory Manage Inventory, we can see what data is updated. Here is the available quantity, here is the maximum and minimum price, and here is the price. The maximum and minimum price is used for the purpose of automated pricing and also to check that your prices aren't accidentally too low or too high. Going back to the file, the compulsory fields you need to fill in are the SKU. This is, can be seen here under the SKU column. If you just want to change the price, then you can fill in just the price field or just the quantity field. If you want to change the lead time to ship, you have to have a quantity filled in. Maximum and minimum prices are optional fields. There is a macro in the sheet you download from Amazon to enable you to upload products directly from the sheet into Amazon. However, I find this tricky and prefer to upload them directly. If you select the data from the sheet and, and create a new sheet, paste values into the sheet. If you then do file, save as, and then save as a tab delimited text file, that is then in the right format for uploading. You can then go into Amazon, inventory, add products via upload, select price and quantity file, and then select the file you wish to upload and upload the file. Once you've uploaded the file, the status will appear here under monitor upload status. Thanks for watching this video. For more content, please subscribe to our channel or check out our Amazon playlist. You can also see more hints and tips at our website, which is vendlab.com slash blog.